Ten years ago, the Geneva Peace Building Platform, Interpeace, the Swiss Permanent Mission and the United Nations Office at Geneva came up with the idea. What if a group events on different aspects of peace into one week to give more visibility to peace actors and initiatives in Geneva? This is how Geneva Peace Week was born. Since that pilot event 10 years ago, Geneva Peace Week has grown into an annual leading event in international Geneva, which attracts governments, organizations, experts, practitioners, scholars and students. Geneva, often referred to as the capital of peace, has traditionally been a space for diplomacy and international relations. By synchronizing meetings on different aspects of peace, Geneva Peace Week connects various actors and expands further the space for meaningful conversations, sharing of experiences and development of innovative solutions to the global challenges that threaten peace and stability. If I were to summarize the achievements of the decade of Geneva Peace Week in one word, I would say it is the focus on partnerships. This annual event has fostered collaborations among different actors working not only in the field of peace and security, but also on sustainable development and human rights, the pillars of the United Nations. By bringing together a wide array of perspectives and expertise, it has promoted holistic and comprehensive approaches to building peace. It has created opportunities for youth to voice their concerns, ideas and solutions. It has also emphasized the importance of multilateralism, of diplomacy and negotiation as effective tool for peace building. We prepare the event's 10th edition at a very fragile moment, with the highest level of geopolitical tensions in decades, new and developing global threats, more deadly and com complex conflicts, as well as growing inequalities, economic shocks, distrust at all levels, and climate-related emergencies. Global peace seems to be out of reach at the time, when it is so surely needed. In July, UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres presented to Member States his policy brief on a new agenda for peace, which outlines his vision for multilateral efforts for peace and security. It contains an extensive and ambitious set of recommendations that recognize the interconnected nature of many of the challenges we face. A new agenda for peace is framed around the core principles of trust, solidarity and universality that are foundations of the UN Charter and of a stable world. It is hoped that this framework will serve to strengthen the Member States' multilateral efforts in building peace. Under the overarching theme of building trust, building peace, the 2023rd edition of Geneva Peace Week will provide a space to discuss how the recommendations of a new agenda for peace could be put into practice. Join us for Geneva Peace Week. Together, we can forge a path to a more peaceful and just world through dialogue, cooperation and innovation.